Got my GoPro charged up for today. I didn't have it charged for yesterday. It wouldn't even turn on. But we're not going out to the campground today. As you can see that we got a little bit of snow last night. And it's currently half raining, half snowing. So that's probably all for that. So we'll go into the shop and we've got a couple emails to send and uh, a couple vendor forms to fill out. And we'll get our trencher pulled in and start getting it ready because we're going to. We're just gonna trench that electric in. We can trench all that in a couple hours with the trencher instead of backhoeing it in a day. It'll be worth it. And we gotta have something to do today anyway, so. Yeah, I had quite a bit of dozing I needed to do out there today. Did I? I don't even remember if I updated you. We got the French drain in. It's all installed. Our freaking pump is sitting outside though. I don't like that. I might go grab that pump. Shoot, I'm gonna get my truck all muddy if I go grab that pump. Anyways, yeah, so that's what we're doing today. Pretty good shot of it. Pretty good chance of working in here. Well, I'm gonna try not to die under here, so. I don't think it'd kill me, but it'd probably hurt. I don't, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know if I can get in here. Yeah, I don't know where that came from. <sighs> I guess not, no. I don't know how long it's been in there either. Oh no. This is what happens when you get drunk and cook bacon and spill the grease on yourself. The bacon's good. Or get one on your face. Yeah, it couldn't ruin that pretty thing. Where are the pads at? Where are the maxi pads at? I told you, I already got it on. Oh, is this it? Cold. Oh, gauze, yeah. Well, you see, your arm's 800 degrees is burnt. Oh, non stick. Yeah, you need a non. Jeez. You need a non stick pad. Oh, an eye patch. Look at that. <laughs> I mean, these you need. You need something to wrap it. There's, there's, there's a wrap somewhere. Okay. Got that taken care of. Kind of. You can tell. Uh, no, I don't think there is wrap. I need a wrap because those are probably big enough. <laughs> That's what I need. Chuck Norris. <laughs> I don't think an eye patch. Oh, right here. Yeah, that's it. That tape. <clears throat> what are these? Those are the those are the non-stick maxi pads. <laughs> the paper's like. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna crumble. Freaking things from the 80s. What do you expect? Oh, these are nice. You gotta need more than one to cover the whole deal. Oh, That's nice. Stink? It smells clean. Like this. Jesus. This 
just want to cover that blister part up. Oh yeah, bud. How do you get this started by yourself? <laughs> oh yeah, get it in as much dirt as you can. <laughs> I ain't worried about infection. If he was alone in the woods, he would die. <laughs> Yeah, that's why he's got to come to work and get doctored up because his wife won't do it. She every time she suck it up. every time she touches him, she gets pregnant. <laughs> it's out there to all you women that can't get pregnant, <laughs> give me a holler. It's that's that's nice. Feeling better already. You're doing a great. I mean, it looks good too. Is there tape? I, think I need to go through my thumb. I, I don't think I don't think so. You're not oh, yeah. a boxer. <laughs> Is there tape? I guess you just have to tie it up. There's not tape. Now you have to put all this back. Make it look nice. Because we might need this again. And, you know, does this have a year on it? I think you just stick it. They don't even have a. Does it? On the back. OSHA first aid. I don't think it expires ever. Unless they're on here. Just tuck it in there. I feel like I got a cast on now. This is 1997. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm sure it's still good. Can't run it full blast. It's just a little wall heater. You can't run it full blast. Patience. You just gotta turn it on a little bit and just get a little bit of hot water. It still don't get hot. Did you get it out yet? No. We've been working here for two and a half hours. And this freaking got done. thirty years without hot water. You should be <laughs> glad you got that little bit. He ain't gonna do nothing. Seriously. This sucks. Hey there. Have you seen them? Pull them up on YouTube. They're different. I mean, they're not like a lot different, but the booms and stuff are. I think they said they're trying to make the cab a little bigger. Yeah, the boom's supposed to be the highest lift yeah. and all. Yeah, they're just a little bit different. They're probably, they probably burn oil just like that one. This makes for better footage. He's got to get after it, bud. <laughs> I already cut all those, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I about did, got it. I did that for a while, the whole unwinding it. Yeah. But then I just started cutting it again. I feel like cutting it's going to be easier. Yeah. Who oh. trenched through all this stuff? I didn't do this. I don't know where this come from. That's a lot of electric line. This is phone line, ain't it? What's this? No, this is electric too. Garage doors broke. Yeah. Called our garage door guy. He said, "What's wrong with it?" I don't know. You're the garage door guy. Come look at it. Come off. 
Can't get a good garage door guy around here. Oh my god, there's like three inches on the ground. Brandon, what? Brandon's taking over for me for a little bit. Oh, my arm's tired. It gets tired, don't it? Yeah. It's clean. You didn't get none of me it's doing clean. it? It's clean. What are you talking about? I did every bit of this. <laughs> I show the wire. I did it all. Show the wire? I showed the wire. Brandon wow. worked on it for 30 seconds. And got over half of what Matt got. That's a lot of wire. I've it, bud. You think we should splice that together and hook a light up with it or something? <laughs> All right, I'll let this tape it together. I'm going to let the boom down so you can get back to work. What happened? No. I checked the hydraulic oil when that was up. Oh God, it's gonna, it's gonna spill, out spill out everywhere. Out of there. I never thought about that. I let it come down nice and slow. It was probably three gallon low though, so you'd be all right. I can hear it. Tell me when, Brandon. We gotta tighten the chain. Always gotta tighten the chain. There's never been a trencher chain or a fan belt tight enough in this shop leg. ever. <laughs> What's your optimal greasing height? Well, that looks pretty good. Yeah, I kinda like that. Okay. There it is. This freaking thing. It's like Andrew Camerata over here with the Craftsman's. I don't think he ever had one of those. That works. Worked pretty good, actually. It's both stuck. Funny looking wrenches. <laughs> That's what they made That's what for. This motherfucker. They used to bolt. It's got a kink in it. They used to bolt like to the side of it. Or something. Oh, really? Somewhere, yeah. That's a track adjuster. It's got still a little wobble. This thing was like. We ever used those before? We they were buried them. in that. Well, and these no, they these bearings weren't shimmed right, and so you had to like, oh, crank it. yeah, <coughs> to get a pipe, pipe wrench, stand on a pipe wrench, and whatnot. Oh man, do more. He's gonna touch him and be like, oh, it's not tight enough. No more. Might need shims on this. Did you grease that thing? I don't think that's good. I think it's broke. It just fills up. Grease. Yeah, it just that's it just goes in this. Uh, they keep this one getting locked up. The whole looks like it's broke. Oh man. That was too much. Fine. He's pushing all kinds. He's pushing every button on there, man. 
I know. It's never gonna work right. Oh, it's got red. Nope, oh, side light. Got a red light. Do you see the red light? Yeah. Do you see it? I didn't hear you say it's got a red light. I didn't hear you. What happens when it's out of adjustment, Brandon? You gotta take the leak out. Yeah. But I already know this. Is that Smart. tight enough? Smart. Boom's coming down. Yeah. Boom's coming down. The other way? No, he's not. The eye is always in the way. I just had to walk around. <laughs> yeah, you did it. Something bad. Hurt my hand, okay? Sorry, I missed the chain tightening. Where'd you go? I just went and stood in the other room for a little bit. <laughs> While you guys were doing that? It wasn't bad. That, that right there is some quality welding. See, when it broke off, you just move it down and weld it again instead of yeah. fixing it. I bet I know who was in charge of that. If you tried to fix it. What's wrong with the key? It's just loose. Whoever installed it didn't do a very good job. Nathan. I mean, it works. It's just kind of, yeah, it's kind of. Oh, uh, just means like tightened. Yeah. Yeah, whoever put it on there sucked. And we need to get rid of all these other keys because it's really confusing. Well, this sucks. We're actually getting more snow than we were supposed to, so. Yeah, we got the trencher all finished up there. And, uh, still waiting. We're going to do a little, get away from me a little bit. We're going to do a little work on the exhaust, but uh, the parts aren't going to be in till tomorrow. So, tomorrow's Saturday. I don't know, I might go get them, but I'm going to head home, and uh, well, I'm going to get something to eat, and I'm going to head home. It's, it's, like, it's like the same. One in there, Casey's. Get me a little sandwich before I head home. It's a big Democrat fundraiser and marching to the streets. Okay, so Pretty well crap shoot at this Casey's. Whether you're going to get any food or not. They don't have food. Well, they do have food sometimes. Sometimes they don't. But yeah, I think we've gotten... This is a little more... Than we were thinking we were going to get. I'm going to head, just head through town here. And get back out on the highway instead of trying to make that J-turn. Cause that thing's stupid. Funny how. Yeah, pretty good little uh, snow shower here. We've had 50s and 60s for the last couple weeks. Get down about 25, 30 at night, and then this hits us. So. Yeah, great. We'll head through the historic town of New London. I don't know if it's historic or not. This is where I went to school at. The courthouse up here on the left. It's built in 1858. And it's still in operation. got pictures of Harry Truman delivering a speech on the steps of that old courthouse well we're back after the snow the rain and snow we got 
bunch of it melted yesterday um, on Sunday but we're at the shop today we're gonna get the oil changed in the boss's truck get the work trucks kind of straightened out get the backs of them everything we don't need cleaned out and um, Nathan and Brandon are working on that stuff right now and I am on my way into Hannibal to pick up some oil and filters and some exhaust pieces for our trencher and then when I get that delivered I'm gonna go up to center and grab our big pump that we left sitting outside all weekend in the rain and the snow so yeah anyways it wasn't running real good when we was using it last so we're gonna go grab that and look for some parts in the trailer bring it back to the shop piddle with it and, and then we'll see what's that i don't know i don't even know how long that that's not gonna take me very long so yeah we might have a, a, a nooner or sooner today <laughs> all right look at all this good stuff we got Whole box full of stuff. $170 worth of stuff. Rain cap's not here though. I'm gonna go ahead and go, buddy. Uh, rain cap's not here yet. That's alright. We'll just swing back by after lunch and pick that up. Uh, I'm gonna go drop this stuff off. There's our weird little Sasquatches again. You've seen those before. I'm gonna go drop this stuff off and run up to center real quick and grab our pump. What are you doing there, old timer? A bunch of oh god, watch the door. Jeez. All right, let's see here. We'll go ahead and turn down Broadway this time. busy downtown today do a little downtown action used to drive up and down this when we was kids on the weekends I mean like why is this light why is this light still red that guy's been sitting there forever It's kind of cool what they do here in Hannibal. They paint on all these buildings. Thanks. Rattle. Rattling the whole thing. Pretty nice town, really. Kind of got a bad rap on that one documentary about that chick that went missing. I mean, get me wrong, there's some. I mean, every town's got them. But other than that, you know, it ain't it ain't bad. There's this nice little bar to eat at right there, Broadway Bar. Why? Why do? Come on. Why is everybody else got green light but me? About to go. I'm the only guy downtown. Oh. I got a story if you could I'm not gonna say his name but if you could read it you'll know we had our excavator sitting on a job oh, geez, let me get rested here we had our excavator sitting on a job and it was a clearing job and we had our thumb on and our thumb was down and everything and they got well, I don't know what the deal was. They were cutting up some of the wood. I don't know if it was for the people or whatever. Anyways, they were there digging wood out of the piles that I'd piled up and cutting it up. Well, 
I guess they thought that was too hard. So they got in our excavator and was using our excavator to pull the trees out and cut them up without permission. Nobody said they could use it. They assumed they could use it. Well, my dad went by, just happened to be driving by the job, and he seen our excavator running, and he assumed it was me, and he couldn't figure out why I was there working, because I was done. So he pulled in there, and it was these guys running our excavator, and we're probably lucky he didn't have a heart attack or a stroke or both or be put in prison for murder because he was not happy. And I think he conveyed that pretty well to the guy that was on the excavator. Anyways, that being said, um, you know, we, we talked about you know, calling the cops or whatever, and we just decided to let it go. And the guy's property that they were on, he run them off also. Said he, you know, that's not the way he wants to, he don't want to have people like that. Jeez, that truck was wrecked. He don't want to have people like that on his property. Uh, yeah, so, lucky the old man didn't stroke out that day when he called me on the phone, so. Anyways, that's a little story about that company, Hannibal. Like I said, I ain't gonna say their name on here, but I showed the sign, so you can you can figure out who it is. Kind of a vlog today. That their parts dropped off. We're gonna start working on that stuff, and uh, I'm going to Sentinel. We should have came earlier. been a bad idea we'll see I don't think I'm gonna be able to get down there still just a little crusty I think that might help us maybe boy it <laughs> we we made the right call not going out here today My dumb butt's still out here. It's holding me up. Can I get to that pump? There you go. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, we're gonna get muddy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 
Oh. Oh, man. I was hoping not to. Man, look how close I got. I got way too close. That's all right. We'll get my boost mod. He has been wearing this tonight. Oh, I gotta pick this up. this up. Can you help me pick this pump up, please? Huh? Can you help me? Stay right there. I think I'm ready. Saved. Yeah. Got a little lucky mucky. Not bad. Not too bad at all. Better than I thought was gonna happen. Alright, let's um leave. Jeez. So should have came here um, first. Yeah, freaking mud. Should have came here first. I'm gonna get the white gloves out. I ain't going crazy on it. Bro. I didn't even know this truck had a back seat. I thought all it had was boxes, cases. I don't look very good. 
We're doing the inspection. Oh man, I might have to shut the camera off. <laughs> huh? You could get it sucked out, couldn't you? Come on, tell me the truth. I don't know who's responsible for this. Gutters are dripping off. Oh, now what happened? <laughs> Freaking caught it. You should have went to the doctor. You got to rip that off now. Put it back on. Oh, don't put it in. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Gross. Well, you yeah, need all to, that's going to rip off. You there. need to wrap that again. Yeah, I'm going to have to. Freaking sicko, man. Nathan's got, he's hired a kite over here messing with this pump. <laughs> so I keep starting it. Oh man. I can't get by the. Oh geez. What's happening? There we go. Uh. Somebody. Whoa. Filled this trash can up with junk. Trash cans aren't for trash. You're supposed to throw the trash on the floor. Everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. Seen that trick for heavy. That thing about wore me out. Boy, she's looking good. Looking good. She's 23 years old. Dad's coming with the other exhaust parts, so I just went ahead and rinsed this off. We're going to use the bandsaw, Brandon. You just going to cut her off, bud? Yep. Whoa. That thing went kind of crazy. Is that technique? One-hander? <clears throat> shouldn't have put that clamp on there. It shouldn't be a lot. I know. What? Nathan, how do you make this go further? What? This. Oh, you. Pop that up. 
This? Yeah. Oh. And you gotta go to the next deal down there. I think I'm there. No? Part of the plan. <laughs> Trying to make it till three, ain't you? <laughs> oh no. You are. I ain't trying to. You gonna make it till four or what? You just stick those down in there. You don't want to. I don't want to. Why? It's gonna be cricket. That thing is. <laughs> I'm gonna have to take that <laughs> off, ain't I? It's just gonna cut out. Easy. Golly. Won't you stick bolt down in that little crack? Cause I don't want it down in that little crack. Why? It'll hold better. Cause then I'll cut too much off. Oh, he just tried to cut right through there. This is on the internet, by the way. I see you struggling, huh? Yeah, it's normal. I don't even need to cut it off. <laughs> he didn't try, he didn't just... <laughs> Perfect. Look at that. Yeah, they're gonna come flipping up out of there. No, it ain't. It needs something. It's something under. Just a little something. Something to shim under there? Yeah. That's too bad. Just write your initials in it or something. Yeah. <laughs> I'm new. I don't know what Thanks I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> Flips the switch. Switch yeah. right there. All right. That went real smooth. You'll even see it on the video. Beep, beep, beep.
That's the red. See if it works. You're ready to roll, bud. It's fired up. Oh yeah. I gotta shoot it right off her. <laughs> <laughs> It works. It works. Sure it works right. Too quiet. Here it does, I bet it